Little information at this point. What we know, it flew about 300 miles before landing in the Sea of Japan. U.S. Pacific Command says they believe it's a medium-range missile, given the initial read on the distance, so not the intercontinental ballistic missile that North Korea has been threatening to test. It was used at the same launch site that was used uh, last month uh, near Pukchang. That test failed. However, experts say that last weekend's test showed significant advances in North Korea's program, surpassing perhaps even Pyongyang's expectations. So they see these tests uh, less as political provocation than the hallmarks of an advancing program and a ramped up schedule of tests in order to hone different aspects of it. This also suggests that Kim Jong-un may be less interested in talks right now than furthering his technology, despite any pressure he might be getting from China, every test seems to suggest that it's undermining the belief that talks at this point are even an option. Willie? All right, Janice, thanks so much. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.